Hi there, my name is JY Mara. I am from far north Queensland and my mob has a lot of syllables. But more specifically, it's good on Yadai Kenu people of Cape York and Somerset, as well as Miriam people of Murray Island and Saibai Island, the uh, Saibai Cuddle people. And where am I today? Well, in a very attractive basement beneath the legendary Forum Theatre as part of Deadly Funny 2021. Ah! <laughs> This is the second time I've attempted Deadly Funny. The first time was just so nerve-wracking, but also such a blessing because the first time allowed me uh, the exposure that I hadn't gotten in my career as a comedian thus far. And uh, it also scored me a uh, speaking role on Rosehaven. Oh, this is wonderful. I love this, seriously. So uh, I'm a brother from Cairns. I'm an island boy from all the way in far north Queensland. Yes, thank you. You won't cheer for the fact that the chlamydia cases outnumber the people, okay? Oh, you think that's bad? We think that's a fucking achievement. It's weird. It's a- Absolutely. Oh, my goodness. Now, you would have noticed uh, probably by now that I've got a pretty uh, strong command of the English language. You would agree with this. Yes, you're better. Anyway... <laughs> Yes, uh, because typically black fellas have a penchant for not using words like penchant. Uh, <laughs> those of you who laughed, thank you for reading. Uh, those of you who didn't, you can Google the definition afterwards. I've got jokes to tell, okay? Yeah, because yeah, I, I say it in the French way, you know, the way it's uh, meant to be pronounced, not how it's spelt. Because if I said it the way it was spelt, you'd look at me and go, I don't know what he's talking about. Hey, my auntie's on the penchant anyway. <laughs> it's, it's, it's strange, I know. So here's the deal, right? The point is you should never make assumptions, right? So for example, I've just said a very uh, complicated French word to some of you, probably those of you who are from Frankston, but uh, <laughs> but uh, yeah, but the thing is, I am a complicated person, but I'm not actually French. I'm an Islander boy, and uh, the only French part of me is my tongue. <laughs> um, <clears throat> Just remember, the queen waves like this, a far north queen does this. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes, never make assumptions, right? Like, I, that's the thing. I'm, I'm interested in everybody. I love everybody. I give love, usually for free. And the thing that I want to point out to you is that this is such a special thing for me. I'm just a black finger looking for the right ring, honestly. <laughs> Speaking of rings, you probably have no idea that I am a hardcore Lord of the Rings fan. Oh, I love that stuff. Cool, the three people who read, cool. Um, <clears throat> so here's the deal. I reckon Gandalf should have been a black fella. For three very specific reasons. One, he arrives late. Two, <laughs> two, Bilbo says he's got the best weed. Hello. And three, <laughs> and three, I'm sorry to all of the melaninly challenged in the room, but... Uh, None of you could navigate that much open territory without a map. (laughs) Here's the thing. I reckon, because they filmed it in New Zealand, Gandalf should have been a Kiwi. Now, how cool would that have been to have a Maori Gandalf? The problem is, the Kiwi accent is so happy and jovial that it would just undercut every serious moment in the film. So when he's holding on to the clutch of Moria before he falls into the fiery chasm, you know, Frodo's like, Gandalf, no! And sure enough, get you fellas later. <laughs> I'll see you in Rivendell for the Hungry Brew. <laughs> hey, Frodo, <laughs> Kiora, my hobbit brethren. <laughs> We're going to take this freaky ring and drop it into a volcano. Want to come? <laughs> I'm Jay Waimara, that's all I'm good for. I feel good. I feel good. I feel good. I'm glad it's over. I wish it was longer, but then again, I wish a lot of things were longer.